Hi guys, it's Mackenzie, and today I'm going to be doing a monthly favorites. So this is my first ever monthly favorites video, and I'm really excited for it because I have so many things to share. And I actually had more than what I'm showing today, but I didn't want to go overboard for my first one. The first things I'm into are two TV shows. One of them actually got done this month, so it was only, I think it was two episodes into this month, but I still wanted to include it because it's one of my all-time favorite TV shows. The first show is... Game of Thrones! As you can see, I'm wearing my Game of Thrones shirt in sphere of this video. And this actually isn't my copy of the fourth season, but I just wanted to be able to show it to you guys. I've been really, really into watching it. There's two episodes left this season, and I'm really sad because I love the show so much. But every good thing comes to an end, right? I think that's what the saying is. Um, so I'm really excited for the last two episodes. This last episode, I think the eighth episode, was so intense and so good, and I loved it. I'm in love. My favorite character is Daenerys, and she hasn't died yet, which is impressive. So I'm hoping that doesn't happen soon. And I also like Marjorie, but I'm kind of worried about her safety right now. And I'm also starting to read the books. I just am about like 15% of the way through the first book. I don't know how soon I'll be able to finish the first books just because it's not my Kindle that I'm reading them on and so I kind of have to give priority to some other people. The second TV show, I don't have anything to show you with because I don't own a copy of this, but it's Once Upon a Time and I love that show so much. And the season finale was this month, I'm pretty sure. Or maybe last month, maybe this is the wrong month, but I don't care because I love the show so much. Um, it's such a good show. It makes me so happy. I love fairy tales and everything, like, not real, basically. So, it's a perfect show for me. I'm also sorry for the lighting. The sun keeps coming in and out, so there might be times where, oh, look, it's gone now. Okay. It's, like, lighting my face and darkening my face. I don't know if I said this in my last video, but I don't really have an inside space to film right now, so outside is my best bet, and it's creating very unflattering shadows on my face, and yeah. Sorry. The next thing is a movie, and this technically isn't the movie that I'm including in my favorites, but this is the Avengers, and I loved Avengers Age of Ultron. So I have this because it is representing Age of Ultron, but I saw that movie three times in theaters. I did fall asleep the last time, but that's not my fault, because it was my third time seeing it, and I was really tired. So this is the next thing. It is this lovely blanket. So this is the blanket that my boyfriend got me and I love it so much. It is a really long blanket which you don't always get with like throw blankets but I think he got it from Target. I'm pretty sure I saw it and I was like I want this and then he bought it and then wouldn't give it to me until an anniversary or like a birthday or something which was disappointing, but I love this blanket so much and it's so soft and as long as you air dry it, it doesn't get, you know, the icky, it doesn't get like hard and like not soft anymore, it's, it stays soft. Not as soft as when I first got it, but it's still really, really soft. This next one is kind of a nerdy one, not that the rest of them haven't been, but I've been loving my Nintendo 3DS so much. I love it, I love it so much. And the game I love most to play on it, which is in it right now, is Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. There you go. There it is. There it is. I've always wanted to do this. Usually people do this with makeup, but I'm going to do it with my Pokemon game. Um, I really, really love this game. I just beat it, and so now I'm working on getting like legendary Pokemon and stuff. Um, but I've been really obsessed with it this month, so I thought I'd share that with you. There are two songs I've really been obsessed with this month. The first one is Honey I'm Good by Andy Grammer and so good. I've been obsessed with these songs. I don't know how long they've been out. I feel like they've been out for a decent amount of time, but like for like the past couple of months that I've been out. Unless it's unless they just came out this past month, but I'm not really sure. Anyway, I've been really obsessed with them. Honey I'm Good is so good and it's really really upbeat. I can count on this song whenever I'm in a bad mood just to like lift my spirits because it's just that fun of a song. The second song is Shut Up and Dance by Walk the Moon and this song makes me so happy because it's also really upbeat and it kind of reminds me of like, I'm not sure which decade but like a 70s, 80s decade, like an older, older decade. That's kind of what it 
sounds like. I don't know. It's really, it's a really fun song. They're both really fun songs, so thumbs up to those two. My last favorite for the month is actually a cup that I left inside and I don't want to screw everything up. I'm going to attempt to get it and clip it in at the end of this video or maybe right now, but I don't want to ruin where I'm sitting because I'm not going to be sitting in the exact same spot when I come out, but it's a cup that my friend from Hawaii, she's actually, she's just going to college in Hawaii. She doesn't live in Hawaii except for like throughout the school year. Um, so she lives in Hawaii and she sent this over um, over the water all the way to me here in Michigan and it's a cup it's like a mason jar without a handle um, it is just like a I don't know it's a mason jar without a handle but it's got one of those straws they like inserted a straw spot for it which is like yellow and white stripes and it's really cool and it says aloha down the side and it's just it's just really cool and I've been drinking out of that cup almost every single day except for when I leave it at my boyfriend's house but that which happens a lot actually but I really really love using the cup and I would like to be able to tell you where I got it because it's that awesome of a cup and you should like check it out but I don't really know where she got it because it was in Hawaii and I wouldn't have access to that place and that information unless I really asked her but I don't even know if she knows thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one